Hi dear students, welcome to today's class. Today we are going to discuss the sixth lesson from your textbook Nasruddin's aim. What is the heading? Nasruddin's aim. Who was Nasruddin? Have you heard the name Nasruddin Hoja? He was a very famous person who lived in Egypt many many years ago. Okay. He was very clever, very intelligent. So, here we are going to one of his funny stories. Okay, Nasruddin's aim. What is the meaning? Aim. Aim means in Malayalam we say unnam. Unnam pidikya. Okay, when we throw a stone, first we will aim. V uh, aim where we want to hit the stone then only we will throw it isn't it it is called aiming so let's read the story one day nasruddin was chatting with his friends what is the meaning chatting chatting means talking so one day nasruddin was talking with his friends he began to boast no one can match my skill in archery. He began to boast. What is the meaning boast? Boast means talk in a very proud way. He says uh, about himself very proudly. Okay, boasting. So he was saying that no one can match my skill in archery. There is no one who can defeat me in archery. What is the meaning archery? Archery is the sport of shooting with a bow and arrow. Look at the picture. This is archery. I string the bow, take aim and shoot the arrow. Whoosh. Okay, what does he say? Uh, he strings the bow, he takes aim and then shoots the arrow. The arrow is sure to hit right on target. Okay, if he shoot an arrow, it will hit right on the target. What is the target? This, uh, target is a place we want to hit the arrow. Okay, you can see in the picture what is the target. Hearing this, one of his friends immediately brought a bow and some arrows. So when Nasruddin said that I am the best in archery. One of his friends brought a bow and some arrows. Giving them to Nasruddin, he said, Here Nasruddin, take this bow and arrows. So, giving the bow and arrows to, the Nasru to Nasruddin, he said that here are some arrows and a bow. Take this bow and arrows then pointing towards a target he said aim that target and shoot an arrow so what does the uh, friend said to Nasruddin uh, you have to shoot the arrow because Nasruddin said that he was the best in archery so he wanted to prove that he wanted to show that skill in front of that ability in front of his friends so one of his friends gave him some arrows and a bow nasruddin held the bow in his hands strung it aimed at the target and shot an arrow but nasruddin took the arrow and he shot the arrow to the target Ooh. But what happened? The arrow didn't hit the target, but he could not hit the target. Instead, it fell down somewhere in the middle. The arrow even didn't reach near the target. It fell down in the middle. Ha ha ha! His friends started laughing. They said, Hey Nasruddin, is this your best aim? So Nasruddin was boasted that uh, he is the best in archery. So everyone began to laugh because Nasruddin couldn't hit the arrow on the target, isn't it? So everyone began to laugh. Ha ha ha. Okay, they said, 
Hey Nasruddin, is this your best A? So what did Nasruddin say? Oh no, not at all, said Nasruddin, defending himself. This wasn't my aim. It was Azad's aim. Oh, not at all. This is not my aim. This is the aim of Azad. Okay, Azad was shooting like this. I just showed you how Azad shoots a bow. This is not my aim. This is Azad's aim. Saying this, Nasruddin picked up another arrow. So saying this, what did he do? He took another arrow. Once again, he strung the bow, aimed at the target and shot the arrow. Once again, he strung the, uh, uh, pulled the bow's string and aimed at the target and shot the arrow. This time, the arrow fell a little further from where it had fallen before. So what happened? Did it hit the target? No. It fell down a little further from where it had fallen before. Okay. It reached only a, a far more distance than the earlier arrow. But it didn't hit the target. But it certainly didn't hit the target. Definitely, surely it didn't hit the target. They asked Nasruddin, and this must be how you shoot an arrow. Again, his friends began to laugh at him. And they said that this is your aim. This is uh, uh, how you shoot an arrow, isn't it? Of course not, argued Nasruddin. But what did Nasruddin say? No, of course not. Even this aim was not mine. It was the chief god's aim. What did he say? Ah, this is not my aim. Uh, this is chief god's aim. Okay, chief god means the head of the military of that country. Okay, this is how the chief god uh, shoots an arrow. This is not my aim. I am not like this. Okay, he was again defending, arguing. Okay, he was not ready to accept his failure. So, we could understand that he was uh, not a good archer. He cannot hit the target. But he was boasting that I can do that. Okay, I, I am the best in archery like that. Okay, so in order to escape from that, he was arguing that first he said that it is it was Asad's aim and second when he failed the second time he said that it was the chief guard's aim. Now somebody remarked well now who is next on the list? Now somebody said that now whose name you are going to say Next, now who is next on the list means now whose name you are going to say next. Hearing this, all the friends burst out laughing. Hearing this, all the friends began to laugh at Nasruddin. All of them began to laughing. Nasruddin didn't say a word. He didn't say anything. He quietly picked up one more arrow. He silently picked up one more arrow and again and again he shot the arrow and this time Nasruddin was really lucky and the third time he was really lucky. The arrow hit right on the target and he was very lucky that uh, he could hit the arrow on the right target. Everybody stared at Nasruddin. Okay, their mouth agape in amazement. So everybody stared at Nasruddin. Stared means looked. Everybody looked at Nasruddin. Their mouths agape in amazement. Agape means their mouths are open in wonder. Amazement means wonder. Okay, all of them are surprised, wondered. And they opened their mouth in wonder and looked at Nasruddin. 
बिफोर एनी वन कूड से एनी थिंग नसरुद्दीन सेट ट्राइम्फेंडली डिड यू सी दैट इट वॉज माई ए के बिफोर एनी वन कूड से एनी थिंग बिफोर एनी वन कैन से एनी थिंग नसरुद्दीन सेट ट्राइम्फेंडली वॉट इज अ मीनिंग ट्राइम्फेंडली वेरी हैप्पीली एंड प्राउडली नसरुद्दीन सेट वेरी हैप्पीली एंड प्राउडली दैट डिड यू सी दैट Okay, did you see that? It was my aim. This was my aim. This is how I shoot a arrow. I told you that I am the best in archery. Okay, so everyone surprised. And what did you understand from the story? Nasruddin was not at all a good archer. Okay, he was not the best in archery, but he is boasting. He is saying. proudly about himself and when he failed first time he escaped the situation saying that it was someone else a okay he did it two times when he failed for two times he said others names uh, for escaping the situation and uh, for his luck he hit the for the third attempt he could hit the target he could hit the, the arrow the target so he said that ah this is it was my aim did you see that it was my aim so he could manage his defeat okay he could manage to escape from the situation so that's why i told you earlier he was a very clever person okay so do you understand the story now you read it and enjoy it okay thank you